Hi guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Jagged Alliance 2 Urban Chaos 113. Uh, when we last left off, we were dealing with some kind of bitchy ambush, and I think we were most of the way through it. And I just realized Fraps is putting the FPS counter in the corner. That's just... That's great. Good job, Fraps, for resetting my defaults without telling me. Oh well. Technical difficulties 20 seconds in. Wouldn't expect anything less from me. Anyway... Uh, let's kill guys. That's what we're good at. And music's a little different today because I'm in a spaceship's mood, so you're gonna have to deal with that. If you don't like it, too bad. But we're too busy seeing. <clears throat> oh, excuse me, pig dogs or big dogs? Did he say pig dog? Yes, pig dog. Pig dog. That'd be more appropriate if it was the police. And none of them are in range at the moment. Nope, not even Mad Dog with the one gun that I feel like should be able to do it. Ah, uh, well. Um. Well, at least move them closer to where the action's at. I'll move the psychos down here. And we'll see what happens. He's gonna run away like a pussy. That's not surprising. We'll let him keep running away, I guess. Oh, Mad Dog. That's usually the best strategy. I have a feeling this music is too loud. I'm going to turn it down. Maybe it's just because it's different than the other music I usually listen to, but it sounds like it's about on par with the voices. So let me fix that one minute. There, let's try that. Awesome jump cuts, horrible music, awful production values. It's, it's amazing, right? Um, so Tex sees this dude. He's not even facing us, but we're going to shoot at him anyways. Because he's Tex. And he does what he wants. I'll take it. He's hurting. And he fell over. I'm just fine with that. Oh, and we got some funky, tactical dude in camouflage here. That's out of range of the shotgun, so... <clears throat> Actually, we'll have him lay down. And Skits can look at him, too. And lay down. And Tex can shoot this guy. So... Actually, I'm kind of curious, what did we kind of stumble onto? It looks like I car accident or I don't, yeah cuz the dude ran into a tree and it's kind of cool actually mad dog has a shot nice two more sergeants that we got to wipe out fine with me tech should be able to do it right 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 there, well, ain't perfect, but I'll take it. Critical sergeant. There's not too many dudes left at this point. I think they're all hurting. <clears throat> I need Mad Dog to get some kills in here, so we're going to start having him move forward here. And that didn't work out in his favor. Now he's going to throw shit at us. God damn it. How do these guys not... Well, maybe because there's a rock in the way. Yeah, that's what I thought. Good job, Reuben. Oh, that's mustard gas. And that's a dude with a machine gun. You did get hurt, though, Reuben. <laughs> you just got shot. Oh, psychos. What am I going to do with y'all? Well, they're just going to soak up the mustard gas. Because that's, you know, they have gas masks. I'm glad they're getting some use. Tex is going to mow that guy down. These guys are going to get shot up a whole bunch. Uh, 
I think at least this is the last of the aggressive forces. There's four left. I think one of the guys is like knocked out. Ruben's not gonna get anything accomplished. Skits is hurting. Mad Dog is just chilling in the mustard gas. He doesn't care. We can't see this dude apparently except when he fires, so that kind of sucks. This rock is luckily providing lots of wonderful protection. I don't understand why Skits can't see him. Whatever. Mad Dog, we don't need stealth anymore because we're fucking being shot at. And there's the guy. Oh, and there's a <laughs> there's civilians out here. Those poor bastards. We're gonna move him forward though. See if he can get some shots off. Hey, gained a point of marksmanship. 94. <clears throat> and now they're shooting... Oh, God, what's going on? This ambush... Well, it's not even an ambush. It was an ambush, and then it not was being an... <laughs> oh, my God. What just happened to my speech? I need a sip of tea. Ugh. I feel like I'm hyper today or something. It's kind of weird. Mad dogs. Whoops. Yay, gained another point of marksmanship. He's too far out of range for that, so hopefully we can wipe out this guy. And we still need to deal with the dude that's shooting at the psychos. Tex, keep moving forward. I want to see if we can find that guy that's bleeding out. Uh-oh, Ruben's vulnerable side is coming out. Yeah, I know you're bleeding. We'll patch you up after the fight, but where's the guy? Skits. Come out into the open. Where the fuck is he? That's just shitty. Um, even if you can't hit him, shoot at him. Make him be sad. You know, make him coward. Or you can pump skits full of bullets. <clears throat> okay, I know it wasn't the most tactically sound decision to just dump the guy out in the middle of nowhere, but we have med kits and drugs. That'll work, right? Maybe? Can Skits fire? No. We need Tex to come in and save the day. Or the moron will do that instead. So we'll just have them keep moving, and we'll have Skits get back here and... These guys can uh, not shoot. That's not the right action. At least have him start patching himself up. Skits, just sit out in the open and do the same. Tex, you're going to pursue this asshole and we're going to fucking get him. Good, so my psychos are all patched up. Skits is exhausted. Understandably. Where's the dude that was over here? Did he... Is he... I think... That means we won? Yes, we did. Okay, the guy, the fucking pussy ran off. So... There, we will automatically apply our first aid. Reload everything. Ruben. That means you too, Ruben. Um, and we'll check out the spoils here. I don't think these get revealed. Uh, do they? I think they do. They might have just not dropped anything. This thing's happened. Uh, wow, whole bunch of <laughs> these poor people had to kind of uh, 
just stand around and oh there was beer in the car some guy got drunk and smashed into a tree and died apparently there's just a whole bunch of civilians chilling out while we murdered a patrol here on the bridge they didn't really care never seen that green text before cool uh, so what was our haul leg protectors are nice Car 15 is kind of nice, with a flash suppressor and a telescopic stock. Did I say that right? Might not have said that right. Uh, anyway, we're going to grab everything. Why? Because I hoard bullets. And we'll put these... Can I fit seven? No. That's cool. We're just going to pick up everything our greedy hands can get. Why? Because, I don't know, maybe I'll sell it. Oh, the alcohol is in really bad condition. There's only 2% of the bottle left. The guy must have been, like, really thirsty. Can't say I blame him, though. Alright. So those guys, I'm going to give them a few minutes to rest up. In the meantime, uh, I'm going to head back into this sector of Port Kip. And I want to see if our lady friend is in one of these police buildings and maybe I missed her because that certainly seems to be a possibility or maybe you know like I said earlier maybe she spawns in is she in here will this open no wait nails is our door opener right. that's right we don't see is that no it's just some fat guy in here, so we'll see if we get this door open. Yes, and there's a question mark lady in here. Hitman has the highest leadership, so I'd like to have him talk to the ladies. Because we all love Hitman. He's going to show her his hot dog. Show her his hot dog. Yeah, baby. Alright. So I think this is Miranda. <clears throat> Let's see. Miranda. Yeah. Was your name Maria or Miranda? And why is your portrait unusually photographic? Of course I'll go with you. What did you expect me to do? Sit here? Yes. So many things went wrong with this planet. Where do I At the beginning. First, I was hidden. Practically on camera. Well, mostly on camera. Until my father's freak turned on. I suppose he's hiding somewhere safe while you rescue me. Just to wait until I get my Kinky. Yes, I would like to escort Miranda. Yes. Whoa. Yes. Her portrait tards out when she talks. That's pretty awesome. Just kind of curious what kind of stats she has. She's a really bad marksmanship, I'll tell you that much. Although, I'm wondering... Well, no. Look at her eyes, man. She's... <laughs> That's fucked up, man. Um... Where am I supposed to bring her again? I don't remember. Bruce. Bruce was the photographer, and I think he was north of us. So I'm going to do that. And I'm sorry the speech is quiet compared to uh, everything else. And I don't know if that's because... The sound quality is quiet, or yeah, sound quality is quiet. That doesn't even make sense. If the the mixing of the speech was low or what, I don't know. Maybe my audio was just fucked. I don't know. Look at the way she runs, arms flailing around everywhere. It's like she's goddamn terrified. Yes. Not to mention she's twitching out. Uh, can I have you talk to Bruce? Yes? No? You like happy to see her? Anything? Maybe? Mr. Hurst will 
pay you well for the information, Jason. I appreciate it. Miranda has told me she knows Mr. Krause is interested in obtaining something called an MOD list. I have no idea what this is, but I believe he is willing to pay a great deal for it. He is a real man engaging in various criminal enterprises and always protected by regular bodyguards. I believe he has connections with Satan's son, so be very careful around him. But to all saints, pagan and Judea, we have to move quickly. Call Mr. Luce and tell him you are safe. Need to exit this country immediately. Mr. Luce better lie low himself if he publishes that stuff I gave you. Okay. Well, first of all, it was really damn funny to me that she pretty much insulted Bruce and Bruce brushed it off completely and mentioned something about, hey, you should do this instead and give him documents, blah, 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 blah. So, mock list. Why is that familiar? Um... Is that... Uh, yeah, see, I forgot the mission at the beginning of the game, what we're actually supposed to be doing. I think we were supposed to be rescuing something or getting something. I've kind of lost track at this point because I've just been kind of liberating cities and whatnot because I'm awesome like that. Mm. However, I'm over time in this video. So when I get back, we're going to return the documents to the rightful owner and uh, see where things take us from there. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next video.